I uh, never tried this in my life. It's not gonna be pretty. Rinse it, rinse it, and then okay, take some water out and see if it works. So I don't know whether you remember three or four months ago, I actually reviewed a product called Evo Shaver. This is a compact design charged by USB and portable and very clever indeed by a company called Micro Novelty. Now, uh, the team Micro Novelty asked whether I'll be interested to review the Evo 2.0, which we have here. So I'm very excited about it because I think probably I'm one of the first person to review this product. So thank you very much. So to summarize this whole product, this is the most portable and powerful shaver ever. That's a very good title. And um, it's a portable design. As you can see, it's a flat round shape. It has a 8,000 RPM motor speed. That's incredibly fast, I would say. Dual head design. It means you have two, so shaving. Um, and then it has an IPX6 waterproof. That's very good. And a single charge will last up to 30 days. So. That's really good and very promising indeed. Let's get into the unboxing and test it out because I deliberately did not shave for this purpose. So here it goes. Cool, look at that. So that's the Evo pouch and immediately we got, <laughs> that's very good, the actual shaver indeed. But before we get into that, is there anything under this? Nope, we're clear. And then this one should have all the rest of the component. Right, so we got the USB-C charging cable indeed. If you open up on this side, you get a separate brush so you can clean it after you wash it. Okay, so on the front side of the shaver, we got the Evo logo, very nice. Does that actually do anything? Nope. <laughs> And on the back side, we actually have the sticker says travel lock, lock and unlock. You have to press for three seconds. Okay. So I'm going to keep that in the original condition. And all right. So if we take it out, there's the magnetic feel to it. That's very nice. And we got the actual shaver here. And um, yeah, you can see that, that those are cushioning in very clever. And um, on the downside, you've got the USB-C charging port and I think we got the actual LED indicating where this fully charged or not or charging. And, um, oh, okay, so this opens up this way. So I don't know whether you can see there are two rotary bits that rotate very quickly, 8,000 RPM. Um, and also in the other side on the top, we got these two sort of joints. So the, the way how it opens and closes is really nice because of the magnetic joint here. Oh, I can do that all day. You know, that's really good. I like that. And if we were to press it, and the sound is really calm. That's very good indeed. And let's actually try the three seconds lock, shall we? Three. So, okay. So that's actually definitely locked, but if I to press another three seconds, there you go. So that's how we actually reactivate. So three seconds locks is really clever indeed. Um, so I'm glad they add that thing, but let's do a bit of a risky one, shall we? So if I were to do that, does it actually rotate? Yeah, it's a really cool effect there, don't you think? Um, and then I could press it. That's really cool. You can see the spring action there. Anyway, you can do that all day long. Okay, that's really cool indeed, isn't it? So, let's get into the shaving, shall we? Okay, so for the moment of truth, here it goes. Yeah, I can see that because there's two of them. Much quicker, isn't it? So definitely much greater improvement indeed. I mean, it's just effortless and very quick indeed. And because the way it's designed, because it's like flat, you can actually move around very quickly here. 
and then you could actually push it a bit. There's a good, you know, reason of this design, isn't it? I think they've done it really, really well. Cool, I mean, look at that. That was very quick. Yeah, so here it is, everyone. That was really incredibly fast. So well done. So we've got a bit of um, stuff here, which is disgusting. So let's actually clean it out with water to see whether it works and try out the power of IPX6, shall we? So here it goes. Uh, I never tried this in my life. It's not gonna be pretty. Okay, so let's rinse it, rinse it, rinse it. Yeah, I can see all the stuff draining out. That's very good. Very clever indeed. Just make everything wet. And then, okay, take some water out and see if it works. <laughs> Look at that. It works. Just like what they said. The power of IPX6 indeed. Well done. Yeah, that was a pleasant experience indeed. So it took way less of a time than I thought it's gonna take. And um, it was very easy as well because it's actually flat um, and also wide at the same time. You could actually maneuver it much easier and cover most of the area with the dual cutting heads and so on. And I do like the spring uh, reaction as well. It just really responds to the surface of your skin um, the overall design again it's really attractive it's like this minimalist um, circular flash circular shape on the evo logo on the front if you open it up there's these two cool dual uh, shaving heads and then the finale is indeed when you actually open it up all the mechanical details um, that is actually shown inside. It actually reminds me of transformer kind of details of uh, like all the tiny springs like um, that bounces and also moves as you open and close. And also the, the quality of the material is really good indeed as well. Um, and also the idea because it's the IPX6 uh, suddenly opens up uh, what you can do. For example, like a guy like me, I love to shave right in the middle of my shower after I've actually foamed up face while I have shampoo on. That's when I actually get out of the tub and then shave it. But this, suddenly, um, I don't really need to do that. While in the middle of the washing and my shampoo actually settling in, I can actually do this without actually getting on my tub because it's a waterproof indeed. Um, one thing I have to actually point out though is that the lid. If you're a bit of a clumsy person, if you were to leave this somewhere uh, with the other stuff, um, let's say perfumes and so on in your bathroom. Maybe you might struggle to find it. You might forget to put it on. So the alternative might be, why don't just put it like on the sideways to that like that, or maybe into the bottom. But then again, that kind of opens up the lid, the gap. So it might actually make it a bit loosen. But one of the suggestions I would like to make is that, but yeah, indeed, very, very um, efficient, quick, and um, really well thoughtful um, in the outside minimalist in the inside incredibly designed shaver called evo 2.0 so um, i hope this video gave you an answer of what you're after what you're after regards to this product but if you have any queries please do comment below and thank you very much for watching this video this is ljp tech all the best bye bye